Hello everyone, it's Matt Master Gamer here, and welcome to my Nintendo Channel Walkthrough! Um, you can't do a walkthrough on a channel based on videos. So, uh, we are going to do Book 2 of Animal Crossing Diaries! Hooray! This is the beginning of a new era! Of Animal Crossing Diaries, with live commentary and awesome footage. Yes, I am excited, you are excited, we are all excited. And it's night time, so I'm probably going to have to change the time. Um, yeah, I will. Um, I was just thinking we might catch some night things, but no, I won't. Anyway, other things, change the time. I always get worried I'm gonna tear down the house. Uh, so yeah, we want, we want the date, that's the date. Uh, and now we actually want, uh, what is the time? Uh, it is four o'clock. So, change the time to four o'clock. Yes, that is right. Okay, let's, so we're all set up. So, yes, let's begin. Uh, I am Matt, Master Gamer. I knew you did. It uh, has been a little while, I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, it's been a month, I think. So, yeah. But this is the beginning of more Animal Crossing Diaries. Thank you, Rover. Because he roves about, I guess. And... <laughs> um, I'm stuck on a video with uh, adverts. Anyway, i am got bedhead again. Oh, look, I'm going to have to fix my hair again, just like the first part of book one. But Pete didn't come up and give us this. Did he now? And I wasn't wearing the 2011 shirt. But uh, with a bunny. I love the bunny. Anyway, let's open this. And uh, if you remember in my bonus book one video with Chris, uh, if we read this. Uh, Dear Matt, the gold series is truly fit for royalty. Make this golden chair your very own throne. You'll have to bring it to uh, your own sector and crown, though. From Tortima. So, Tortima has given us... Uh, if you remember last time we got the golden bed, this one is... The golden chair! And uh, if you didn't guess already, my, when I get my downstairs, well, you, well, I don't think you would have guessed, but uh, what my downstairs will be, which will be hopefully this year, trying to get the downstairs. Oh my goodness, cockroaches! Uh, what I'm going to be trying to do is killing all the cockroaches and go, hooray! Anyway, yeah, after killing all the cockroaches, uh, I'm going to have a downstairs of the golden collection. That's what I'm trying to say. Uh, and let's just show you the golden chair of golden goldenness. There it is. Put it in the room. And there it is. It is Aztec. Aztecs are pretty cool. And uh, I'm trying to push it here. There we go. So yeah, now I'm awesome. I am King of Matt Master Gamer. <laughs> I'm the king of gaming, even though I do actually suck at games. But... <laughs> I should have called it Map Master Loser. Anyway, up here for no reason at all, just to remind you, my Robo Room. Oh my goodness, it's Power Rangers! <laughs> I don't know. And uh, up here is the golden bed of amazingness. Where did it come from? No one knows. Uh, anyway. Yeah, I'm halfway through, well not halfway through, I'm about to begin watching a episode of Minecraft, if you've ever heard of that game, on YouTube, but the person is, um, is partnered, so I have, I'm stuck on this stupid advert for stuff. And you got something to do with the uh, paws on your face. Anyway, uh, let's look through all the mail, we got bell point notice, I got more money, well it was only 157 bells, but... No. Thank you. And um, I got one from Carmen. She moved. Wow, Matt. Today I'm finally. It's finally the day I leave Bubbles forever. Thanks for being such a great BFF. Take care, Carmen. Well, she might not be, because she might be moving to um, 
marry Sonic or Chris, this is uh, town, and then uh, she might move back here, so it might not be forever. And more Happy Room Academy. Go away. I don't like you. So, uh, now we're done with all of that being annoying. Uh, we can now talk to Scoot. Hello, Scoot. Yo, thank you, Matt. Uh, oh, that to you, sorry, not thank you. Uh, I need my eyes tested. What's with the vanishing act? You, you get in, oh, you get in, what? Well, intimate, intimidated by those awesome cleaves? I didn't get to read that quick enough. Look, I get the, like, zero phone reception in this yo yokel town. So I never know if someone's been calling me. If you're not going to be around for a while, drop me a letter, will you, teddy bear? I think the next Animal Crossing, which will be made for the 3DS, very exciting, even though I'm not getting a 3DS anytime soon, unless one of my DS's break, and then I'll get 3DS. Or when it gets cheaper and it has different colours, because I'm not really like the pe uh, the blue and the black. Nah. Um, uh, that wasn't me trying to go black because I couldn't talk. That was me going black because I don't like those colours. Um, I will be get well, then I'll get 3DS and Animal Crossing for that game. And if I'm able to find a good way of recording, like Super Skarmory does with his videos, that you know, with the camera, and I'm going to try and talk to him somehow. I will be doing walkthroughs on my DS with my camera. So yeah, bad, bad quality, kind of. Uh, and uh, I will be using the 3DS, hopefully, and doing Animal Crossing 3DS Diaries. <laughs> anyway, we're back at Tom Nook's Nookington's. And my foot has just gone numb. And what? Everything sold out? It seems like someone's trying to get points. Wow, everything's sold out. And I'm going to put on um, my happy shirt. Even though I'm sad because everyone bought everything. That's very sad. Aww. Anyway, now we're done with that. Uh, I'll just show you the what I was talking about. This is the Nox Point Tracking System. I'm a bronze member at the moment because I don't buy things because everyone keeps someone else keeps buying them. What you're actually able to do is actually buy things. <laughs> uh, I can't buy anything because I've only ever got 150 points while playing this, and the cheapest one is 500 points. Uh, you're actually able to get different things, and one of those things is a hero's outfit, which is AKA Link, which is awesome. Uh, I have it in my other town, and uh, someday. Oh, what do you want, Nook? Oh, uh, what is it? Uh, are you worrying about the store for a while? Um, yes. Um, be wondering if there might be something more important than having a good variety. Uh, oh! Uh, okay, how about good hours? I want it, I want it, because it's always like, opens up at 9 till 9 p.m., so it, it opens quite early and late. No, it opens late and uh, closes early. There we go. So, um, yeah, it's a bit silly. So, yeah, good hours. That's what I want. And it's Wendell again. Hello there. You want something to eat? Okay, how about I get you some fruit? Uh, tough it out for a bit. I have to go and get myself a piece of fruit. Um, oh, crazy. Snow, snow, snow. I was actually thinking of waiting till spring, but I thought, hey, people love Animal Crossing Diaries. They want Animal Crossing Diary videos, so I'll be doing more. <sighs> and I wanted to begin my new walkthrough and stuff. Uh, and someone's picked all of the fruit, haven't they? Wait, do you get fruit in winter? Oh, yes, you do. Uh, let's go give him an apple. Actually, will I have room for him? I don't have room for him. Uh oh. We will have to uh, go to um, a person in down here to um, save some designs. So uh, let's go to the Able Sisters. And break my back. Why, why is it whenever I play Animal Crossing, I always hunch down? So odd. Anyway, hello, Mabel. I want to store... Um... See design storage, thank you. 
and um, put this here. Uh, put this one here. Put this one here, and put this one here. And that do. And um, yeah. Okay, because uh, I don't really need the umbrella patterns, I don't think, but I just wanted to save those just in case something happens. Um, so, now we're done with that, let's go give him an apple. Or should I feed him Princess Peach? That's what I call the peaches in this game. I don't know why, but I always call all peaches pretty much Princess Peach because of my love of Mario. Um, if there was... And whenever I say a link up, I always say... Link up. <laughs> But uh, I'm always thinking of Link from Legend of Zelda. Anyway, Wendell isn't where he used to be, so he's disappeared. Where could Wendell be? I wonder. I do wonder, because I'm supposed to be feeding him something. But, um, yeah. Wendell! Wendell! Where are you? Where are you? You warus. I don't know. Anyway, um, before I find him, because he's disappeared into thin air, which isn't good for a warus uh, to do, I'm going to go fishing. No fish here. Oh, there's a fish, there's a fish. Hello there, fishy. Hello there, fishy. Hello. Absolute silence. Ah! <laughs> I've always waited for the five, so I'm like, yeah, it's not going to pick it up yet, even though it already went down. So I was like, wait, oh, it's already down. I'm supposed to catch it. But then I missed it. So boo-hoo, boo-hoo. Hey, there's a fishy there. Hello there, fi little fishy. Hello there, little fishy. Where'd it go? It died. Oh, wait, no, it didn't. Yeah, I caught it, and it's a pond smelt. Great. Now, what I don't understand is you can be in, like, three rooms away from this screen, okay? And you're able to move out. Hmm? But then you can't move out because you need the sensor. So I don't understand is how you can be upstairs still and still be controlling your character if you're, if you're in, like, a totally other room from where you are playing the game. I just don't see how that works. I don't see how the sensor for the controls is better than the sensor for your uh, Wii cursor. Uh, what, what I'm trying to say is I don't see why you don't need a sensor for your controls. That's what I'm trying to say. And Wendell, where are you? You big piece of blubber. Oh, there's a snowball there. Now, I'm not going to make a snowball, but I will show you something you're able to do with snowballs. Into the sea you go! Ha 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 ha. Let's catch the snowball now. I want to watch it go all the way down. Oh, there's fishy there as well. Yeah, I caught it. And what is it? It is a sea bass. I hate sea bass more than pond smelt because they are less money. Sea, sea bass are. And they're always big, so you think, oh, something big and exciting is here, but it's not. Winter is the worst time for fish ever. It's the worst time. In a second, I'm going to speed up trying to look for Wendell, because I don't want to be spending all day trying to find Wendell. Anyway, fish, 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 fishy. Oh, that's mean. Oh, bad fishy. Oh, you make me cry, fishy. That was sound like my friend. And I just noticed I'm wearing um, 3D glasses. Why is that important? Well, I've been watching Little Big Planet on YouTube, so that's why it's important. Because um, <laughs> there's a character in that game that wears 3D glasses, so I was just thinking about him. Uh, okay, so um, still trying to look for Wendell. Let's speed this up, and I'm going to talk through the speeding up, so I'm going to sound really odd. So, uh, there's a fishy here. Let's catch the fishy. It's so teeny. It's a teeny little fishy. Okay, here we go. And it's a bit 
Turtling! I thought that was a pale chub, but that's a different fish. Anyway, yeah, now we now now. Let's go find Wendell! La 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 you know, I told him to tough it out and he might have not been able to. Oh, there he is! There he is! He's alive! He's alive! He's trying to eat the radishes! Bad Wendell! I know, I will feed you something. But I'm not going to feed you my apple as I thought. I'm going to feed you the stupid sea bass! Eat the stupid sea bass! Ooh, thank you, good food! Eat the sea bass, man! That's okay. Now give me a design. That's okay. And let's get rid of the wet danger. Horizontal track. That's wonderful. Uh, now there's something you're able to do. Is you're able to collect uh, what is called um, cloth furniture. Not not furniture. Collections. And horiz and track is one of them. Track and path are two different ones. Horizontal, uh, not hor the, the track, you're able to collect all the different like, pathways for the track. And then for horizontal, um, no, sorry, for the path, it's a pathway. And um, I'll be able to show you the pathway just before this video ends. Down here, because I know my way around bubbles now. And just here is the pathway. I also able to get this chest, but I can't remember which fish you have to give him or which piece of fruit you have to give him. So yeah, that's what I want to show you. You can also get uh, characters, a boy and girl character from him. Colouring boy and colouring girl. Anyway, that is the end of this part. Thank you for watching. Let's see if there's one more fish. Will there be a fish just before the video ends? Let's see, will there be a fishy? Not if I keep running, but... Is there a fishy? Fishy! Anyway, let's see. Um, yeah, this is the end of the part. Uh, well, not what part. Day, sorry. Because this isn't my walkthroughs. This is not... Uh, well, actually, my new walkthrough, The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past. Hope you're enjoying it. Uh, description up down below. Um, or as some people say, in my pants. I don't understand that. Anyway, um... Yeah, so uh, next time, I don't know what we're doing next time. I think we're going to make a design. I uh, upgrade my YouTube tea. That's what we're going to do next time. So, uh, that's what we're going to do next time. Oh, anyway, what I was trying to say was my new walkthrough is episodes and not parts. But that doesn't matter. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time for more Animal Crossing Diaries.